Welcome back to the MindMapper instruction and training videos. My name is Arjen Tegoof and I'm the founder of MindMaps Unleashed and Carefree Mind, places where you learn how to remove the noise from your head and environment and create a carefree mind. Okay, a map is a map is a map is a map. And sometimes you don't need a map, you need to have a document. That's what you'll learn today. How to create your mind map into a for instance word document um, and I say for instance because there are a lot of ways you can uh, export your mind map to uh, different tools okay um, I exported my mind maps usually uh, when I was writing books or proposals I create the entire outline in my mind map so for instance I have my title and I have different uh, chapters with different paragraphs with different uh, details or parts of the document in text. Um, I did that and I made sure that all the ideas and thoughts and all the information were at the right location. Uh, for instance, I would remove or move these two around and then, okay, yeah, this is what I need. Okay, this is what I need. So, this is what will be exported. But, of course, I will uh, add some more uh, text to this uh, entire document because we need something which actually has some text. Uh, we'll add more text here and some here. I'm just copying and pasting some text and this way. Okay. Okay, well, now we have a document with information, with different pieces of uh, text. And let's export this now to Word. Microsoft Word, that is. We'll go to the big Mind Mapper button and it says here something like Export. You can import, but now we export. You can export to Microsoft Word, PowerPoint, Excel, Project, Outlook and OneNote. Now we go to um, Microsoft Word, so we'll choose the top one, click it, and it gives us some options. Um, where the file will be saved, if we want to use a template file, we can change the template file as well. Something we can discuss in our uh, coaching call, by the way. Um, I want to launch Microsoft Word once the um, export is completed. I do not want to export it to email. I want to include my notes, of course, because that is where all my text is. Um, I Yes, I want to include hyperlinks because we have a hyperlink here to the uh, other Word document. Uh, relationship lines, yes. Uh, images, other things, no. This is just for a uh, another uh, video training that you will receive soon uh, so okay well we have all the um, options selected only thing we need to do now is click ok and my, my, uh, mind mapper will export our mind map to microsoft word this won't take long and there it is already okay here's our mind map or our document in word as you can see we have i'll move this here we have first chapter, first paragraph, all the text. Second chapter, second paragraph, third paragraph, etc. Links are here as well. When I click this, it opens my Word document. Uh, so everything here uh, is connected and everything shows you the, uh, uh, the outline of what we had in MindMapper, but now in a traditional format. Very nice, very easy to use. I'll click this away. Uh, what you can do as well is you can also import Microsoft Word documents. But it is very important that you use the same uh, structure as is used in our smart mind mapping documents. So we need to have the, um, the right headings. If the right headings are not applied, MindMapper cannot read the document, so make sure that you have all those um, in place. And when you do that, MindMapper can import Word documents, export, etc. So, 
something you probably like to use. But what if I have another presentation I need to uh, deliver? I created my mind map and now of course I'll immediately go to the big mind mapper button, press export to PowerPoint. And I have to stop you there. No, don't do that. Because you have a wonderful mind map which gives your audience all the information in one very nice overview. And what do you do? You go to export PowerPoint and you get slide after slide after slide and your mind map the power of your mind map of giving you everything in one big picture is gone. It's much better to use uh, the mind mapper presentation features or another smart uh, tip that I have for you on how to deliver presentations but that's a whole uh, different story. This is only about exporting. Uh, so make sure that you do not export to PowerPoint. What you can do however is you can save your mind map as a JPEG. So smart mind mapping is now saved as a JPEG. Will I save it to one image? Yes. Okay. It is currently being saved. And there we go. Um, we'll go to our folder, open the smart mind mapping document and we drag in, excuse me, the smart mind mapping image, for instance here. And now we have the image of our mind map in our document. So this makes it easier, for instance, to um, have the complete overview of the map first as a summary for instance and then have all the lines of text and text and text and text the traditional way. Uh, so this way you can um, use mind mapper to create the document and have the uh, summary as a mind map in your document as well. We'll save this and it's ready to be uh, shared with other people if we want to. So Next um, short task for you is create a Word document from your mind map. It's easy, as you saw, mind mapper button, export to Microsoft Word. Once you did that, you have a Word document. Copy into that the um, image of your mind map and you're done. Easy, right? Okay. Uh, still some places, f uh, some spots for the um, personal coaching call. Click in the email on the sign up link, limited number of seats again, um, but I do want to uh, give you the opportunity to connect with me and make sure that you will learn how to mind map using mind mapper. Although of course you have already a lot of knowledge and a lot of skill in using it, but still there's always some things and we can have a look at your mind maps, but we can also have a look at uh, the way you can use your mind maps all available in the coaching call. Visit the uh, address if you see this web, uh, this uh, video without the email received from me. And we'll make sure that you will receive the coaching call email as well. Okay, uh, enjoy your day, enjoy mind mapping, and we will talk very soon. Thank you and bye-bye.